What is going on everybody, welcome back to EU4 as Ashikaga, hopefully soon, well not soon, but to be Japan one day. Um, we're con currently conquering the Ryukyu Islands, pretty successfully, I hope. Who is this? Oh, this is my allies coming to help me, that's very kind of them. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that, but there we go. But there we go, alright, what do we want here? Gain general with 100 to do sin. I'm really focused right now, I got a hate comment on an old EU4 video. If, you, if you're watching, you've inspired me, I'm gonna try and do better, okay? <laughs> I, I probably can't do much better I've, if it was a very damning damning verdict so probably not lose 20 ducats lose 50 ducats gain general with 50 tradition 100 tradition I feel like 100 tradition is, tradition is 3 stars but we could do the legitimacy but I'll take a good general why not please be 3 stars we can't put him in right now anyway but there's actually another army over here Put him on there instead. Oh no, now we got three. Oh my goodness. You see his pips? That was crazy. Five, four, six, three. That is pretty good. We do not have too many. So I will fire, fire the useless one. Goodbye. You're the weakest link. Chance of new air. He is infertile. Are you serious? Do you have an air? We do have one. So that's good. <laughs> Just don't die, please. Just stay alive. You got this. Right, there we go. Siege of Okinawa is done. We're actually fighting their boats. I'd rather not fight their boats. Can I have all your money? Hold 10 ducats. Yes, please. There we go. Ryukyu is ours. Our new islands. That's pretty cool. I'll take that. Let's bring these troops home. By boat. I assume, yep, they're going to hop on the boats. But there we go. We've added, added a new, new area to our domain. And just maybe, if I get the colonist ideas... Oh, I'm only allowed two leaders. Are you serious? Okay, I've got to give, give this one star dude a boot as well. Sorry, mate. <laughs> ah, didn't realise. Alright. This guy's pretty good. How is he only one star? I don't know. Don't know where the line is between one and... I feel like two star is a very small, random, <laughs> random, like, line in the middle. So we do own these guys, don't we? Yes. Okay, that's good. That's another three stack to deal with. That I did not mean to let get away. How is our subjects looking? 139, 200. So we can't, these guys are fully ready to be annexed by themselves. I've not improved relations or anything as far as I can remember. They liberated us. I mean, I didn't liberate you. But you believe that. I'm, I don't know how they got free. Maybe I did liberate. I'm pretty sure I just accidentally... I'm pretty sure there was just some rebels that I missed and they... They survived like that. I just didn't deal with them in time. I, I don't know how. But maybe I... Do you know, maybe it was an option and I just misread it and clicked it. Because at the time, I saw them come up with a raw marriage. And I was like, who are these people? I'll just accept it anyway. Maybe I got it wrong. Maybe I just freed them. No, that's a bad thing. Also, we have a ton of money. So I'm going to pour that in. I don't know where that came from. I don't know. Did I take a lot on the Lost War? Or we just... We are making six a month now, so that's a lot better. But there we go, we're investing in a ton of those to increase our tax revenue. That seems good. Right, has, we, has it been ten years you've been around yet? Can I just go into that annexation? No. Not Fifteen, two years. Okay, we can start this episode, and I mean, we will probably get it done. We'll probably get it done. We can actually get more money. We can turn off the forts. Let's mothball those. Boats can come back. We've got a fairly good navy right now. How are we doing on the missions? How are we up to? What are we trying to achieve? Pacify the north. So to do that, we need to conquer all of these three provinces. I think that's what it means. It doesn't really make sense that we are <laughs> that we pacify it by invading it, but fair enough. Divine wind, navy 90% of force limits. It's 22 of 26, so I'll build... Yeah, we can do that next. Let's get that done. They don't need to be heavies, so we can actually build um, some more transports, which will probably be cheaper. And I think two is probably enough. We'll see. All right, convert a province. Yes, apparently these guys are not following Shinto. What, what a disgrace, guys. Come on. <laughs> we'll convert them over. That's easy. Easy it. National unrest. Fine, we'll take it. I can fight the rebels. Did you guys have not reallied Korea yet? So we can go straight after them, assuming I have a claim. I have two claims. 
Bingo. So we'll go straight after them as soon as that is done in 1530. So this is going to be a good time. I'm going to grab this province hopefully very quickly. And I'll probably add some more to the south. I'm just going to focus on the south. I mean, I'm guessing it's less developed or more developed. I don't actually have a clue. Is, that, is it better? Development 7, 13. Yeah, up here, 6, 8. Oh, yeah, the south's a little bit better. It's not that much difference. The good provinces were mine already. But yeah, that one's 13. It's the capital. We'll go for that one. Obviously, try and unite this island because it's got a really awkward to get to fort. They still have 11 boats. 1, 10. We have 6, 6, 1. So I think we're just... We're still in a sort of advantageous position there. I'll probably do with some more of the other types of boats. I guess we'll grab two galleys as well, just to keep balanced. Build a province improvement. Some more trade power. There we go. Keep bringing in more ducats. So we're losing our vassal income, but I mean, we get the income. So we should be better off in theory once they're vassalized. I don't think it works like that Some for us for some poor reason. Right, is it worth these? Minus 20%, 30%. You need 900. I feel like we should not be spending more than 600. But at the same time, I mean, we, we're nowhere near embracing... No one else is near embracing the institution, though. 588, 558. Okay, we need to try and get some at least. But yeah, I mean, we could be spending some more of those points. I think we should do another little spending spree. Let's spend some admin points. I know we're behind on it, but it brings in money. Up the development all around. Okay, just spend a couple of the different ones. Let's try and keep it to 600. No, sorry, 500. One, two, three. Event friend in need, or we can gain 10 prestige. I'll take the prestige. Don't actually need money, so that notification made no sense at all. 540. Okay, we've spent too much diplomatic power, and now too much of that. Can still spend some military power. There we go. Just keep up in our development. Try and stay the most developed in the region. Or close to it. Uh, development. Here we are. So we're we're way ahead now. We're ahead of Korea as well by quite a bit. Which is pretty good. I can't even see the other guys. They have just dropped right off stability three. We got the highest prestige. Our income's not the highest. I don't know what this is. I think money and treasury. Oh. Okay, inflation 0%, it looks like everything's going pretty well, although 10% inflation is actually pretty bad. No, 0% is bad, you want at least a little bit, you want it to be more than 0. In reality, in EU4, 0% is ideal, so that's fine. I have now completed my mission, so I will take another one. This is going to give us 20 Navy tradition, 20 years of Navy tradition increasing, and Navy morale speed increasing. It is now time that we can actually invade. I sort of missed the missed the clock, so I'm quickly going to annex these guys first. I'm not in a rush. Don't want to make mistakes. There we go. In you come. Join. Okay, they're improving relations with Ming. That's kind of scary. <laughs> Please don't ally Ming. That will ruin the game for everyone. I guess I'm at war with them. The only thing is if I'm at war, okay, this vassal is flying, like 25%. Yeah, I'm not going to jeopardize that. So let's just let that finish, and then we'll invade straight away. Weaken them. Hopefully Ming will not be willing to ally them, because if they do, then we're in trouble. <laughs> if I thought Korea was difficult, like we could probably, you know, with Korea, Korea didn't come to help. We could probably manage that now if they allied them again. But Ming, whole different issue. They are still the greatest great power. The Bomani is doing quite well. Aragon, Muscovy, Poland, Mamluks, France, Osman. No one's embraced the institution. They're all obviously doing pretty terrible. Or it's probably spawned in somewhere random. I think I've had it before, spawned on one of the Spanish islands. So it just takes forever. Right, straight in, declare war. Take Echu or take Tango. Well, Tango is on the border, so we'll go for that. I don't actually know where Echu is. Sounds like a cough. I think I made that joke before, though. We cannot cross that part of the sea. We don't have an admiral, so let's see. Oh no, we do. We do have an admiral. Okay, this is all the same sea, so that's good. So I can now cross all these little border places. Let's let's march in with everyone. Yep, they went straight for that island, but at least we know they're down in the south. 
and we should have blocked these crossings. I don't really know how it's going to work. It doesn't say they're blocked. But I think they're blocked in theory. All right, three provinces, extra, extra night. What? Okay, we've got to go. Through, oh, we've got to go through that fort first. Are you serious? Okay, whatever. The other guys are going to walk around. That's yeah, that works if they want to walk around. Missionary strength up one percent. Nice. That's going to be useful. There is a land battle. We did lose three stack. Ran into the. How come they can just run through? Fair enough. There is no forts down here. That does make sense. I should probably invest in one. <laughs> because they are just rushing through. Having a good time. Oh, they're trying to. Why are you going after those guys? Just ignore me, why don't you? 15k, 9k, 5k to 2k. They're actually pretty close. And we should probably get cannons. No wonder these sieges take forever. I will. After this, I'll reform the army. Fix it. Add some cannons to it. Whatever needs to be done. Um. I'll do what I keep forgetting every single time. We're going to raise those war taxes. <laughs> I seem to forget to do that every single time I play this game. Let's go try and grab these two forts. Hopefully they don't all show up at once. That three stack completely died, which sucks. But I mean, it makes it easier for me to manage. But yeah, let's get all of this south part conquered in red, and then we'll head north. But yeah, I should build a fort probably on this island or something, or one on the border of the island. Just gotta make sure I don't lose it in the future, because it'll be really difficult to get it back. Um, I've been... Oh, I didn't want to lose either, to be honest. Which is obviously the point, but... <laughs> Alright, don't run out of money right now. <laughs> Just hit zero. It's fine. We're supposed to be on zero. It's all good. All good. That's how it's supposed to be. 35%. Hurry up, please. Hurry up. Where does... It... Gave me a three-star general for the best part of five minutes. Thanks, game. I really... Really grateful for that one. <laughs> Best part of five minutes that it gave me him. Very happy. Right, there we go. 55% war score. Please give me another good one. Oh, this guy's even worse than the one I deleted to accommodate the other one. He couldn't write this stuff. He couldn't, couldn't write a better script than that. This is just my luck. Anyway, they are sieging out one of our forts, which means they're not going anywhere. That's good. That means we can kill them. They also they do have a general. Seventeen v fourteen. Let's let's go somewhere without a river to cross. This is gonna be a big battle. And they're gonna run away. <laughs> Wasn't too surprised by that decision from them. I'm gonna go grab this fort. Because that will basically be a hundred percent. I think. Waltz on in. I mean we might be able to get about as much as I want anyway. One, two, three. Oh. Coalition? From who? Mayform. I know you guys always moan at me and say that coalitions are not that likely. So um, I, I just want to take that. You know what, I'm going to actually leave. I need that one because it's part of the war thing. I'm going to take that one just so we've got all the crossing provinces. I'm not going to attack anyone else, so it's not likely there'll be a coalition. Although there is a looming disaster again. I'm not sure what's caused that. But thanks game. I think it's just yeah too much overextension so that's fine we'll fix that as soon as possible please don't have a civil war mothball the forts bring some money in there we go we lost 1000 manpower not bad at all S solid effort and like i said we grab all the sort of border crossing not border crossing sea crossing provinces which will make it a lot easier in future next time we can get maybe these five if we push the boat out a little bit and then <laughs> Hopefully we will we will be well and truly on our way to forming something something amazing. That's the goal anyway. Still two to annex, it's proving kinda of difficult. It might be better just to attack both of them. <laughs> but that does no, it gives us so many penalties, it's definitely not worth it. Okay, please go away. Don't want to fight all these separatists. How, how did that do for us by the way? There we go, 324 development, we keep on climbing, pretty high. We're, yeah, what, a third, no, a quarter of Mings, but compared to everyone else in the region, I mean, we could overtake the Mamluks one day, they're double us at the moment. But we've only got like half of Japan when we got the full thing, we could be right up there. And if we keep spending points on developing provinces, that could work as well. We could, we could generally have a really good go at this, I think. There's still opportunities for us to get down here towards the Philippines. 
if we get the next idea group, that's what I didn't think about. Yeah, it's at 7, which is still miles away for us. But that'll be it for this episode. So as always, if you have enjoyed, be sure to leave a like and a comment down below. Be sure to subscribe as well if you're new to the channel. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.